good morning everyone now i am back first of all we will recapitulate what we have done in our previous class beta we were discussing the story of village Pal palampur in which we have discussed the farm farmer the farming in the village pa palampur and we studied about land that land is fixed the cropping se uh, season village of palampur the farmers of palampur were practicing rabi and kharif both the season then we have discussed the farming pattern in which we have seen single crop system double crop system and multiple cropping is also used in village palampur and then we have discussed the method of farming in which we have seen both the traditional method as well as modern method of farming was used in palampur small farmers were using traditional farming and the big farmers were using modern farming method today we will discuss what were the effect of modern farm farming method scientific reports indicated that the modern farming methods have overused the resources natural resources that means by using modern farming method the natural resources were get exploited so modern farming method uh, put a big question mark on the uh, sustainability of land there were a big question that will the land sustain Oh, by you know, overusing the natural resources make the soil less fertile and reduces the ground water level so now the sustainability of land was an question look in our previous chapter in our previous class we have discussed by using modern farming method the village villages of palampur become rich and become prosperous but now we are discussing that modern farming methods become harmful for the soil but you know everything has two aspects there is positive as well as negative aspects of everything so we will discuss the positive as well as negative aspect of modern farming method when we will discuss modern uh, positive positive aspects of mo modern farming method then we have to discuss about green revolution what is the meaning of green revolution green revolution is the revolution in the field of agriculture that means by using hyv seed by using modern farming method in which hyv by using hyv seeds fertilizer pesticides insecticides and modern method of irrigation we have increased the production of food crops but just after independence there were lack of food crops in india we have to import food crops from britain or america and that was the big challenge before india and uh, by using modern farming method 
we have increased our food production that was known as green revolution so what is the meaning of green revolution increasing the production of food crops by using modern farming method is called green revolution it brings a revolution in the field of agriculture so what were the area in which green revolution we have seen in the decades of 1960 the punjab the state of punjab haryana and western uttar pradesh modern farming methods were used because there were already soil uh, soil was fertile, fertile there and in this area there were natural irrigation system was good and by some effort we have achieved our goal we have increased our food production to which we are called green revolution now we will see what are the advantages and disadvantages of green revolution or you can say modern farming method but due to modern farming method we have achieved green revolution so advantages of green revolution are the advantage of modern farming method and disadvantage of modern farming method is also the disadvantage of green revolution don't forget okay so first of all we will discuss the advantages of modern farming method or advantage advantages of green revolution high yielding uh, high yield due to use of hyv seed by modern farming method we produced high yield means lots of amount of lot of amount amount of food grains in modern farming method we have used machines like tractor thresher that made plowing and harvesting faster and easier high yielding enable farmers to sell the surplus food in the market to earn more money by using modern farming method villagers can earn more money by selling their surplus food grains pesticides and insecticides protect the crop from pests and insects it was the great great achievement because before modern uh, method of farming farmers crops were destroyed by pests but using insecticides and pesticides we have controlled that damage and a good irrigation system enhances the crop production these were the advantage of green revolution or modern uh, farming method now some disadvantage advantages were there also what were the disadvantages by using modern method farming soil fertility start decreasing why when we have used chemical fertilizer that chemical mix with soil and over use of fertilizer loses the fertility of soil then continuous use of ground water for tube well irrigation reduces the ground water level environmental resources like soil fertility and uh, ground water are built up 
by over uh, by over many years once it is destroyed it is very difficult to restore them so next dis disadvantage is chemical fertilizer fertilizers dissolve in the ground water and pollute it when we use chemical fertilizer the chemicals of that fertilizer mix with water and pollute our water resources chemical fertilizer kill bacteria and microorganisms of soil which are helpful for the farmers then increased use of fertilizer and over irrigation make the soil alkaline so these are the disadvantages of modern farming method the next topic i will discuss in my next video so stay